crazy chase of a motorcyclist at 140 miles per hour, and a stolen Nissan trying to escape. This video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. I'd be happy to respond to your comments below the video. This motorcycle chase begins when the police receive several complaints about a motorcyclist speeding and swerving all over the road. After some time of searching, the motorcyclist was found. But of course, he didn't want to stop. As it later turned out, the motorcycle was stolen. Please note how professionally a police officer drives a two-ton charger without having normal brakes for that weight.
The motorcyclist lost control and fell in the grass between the two roads. He then got to his feet, managed to run across the two lanes and fled into the woods. The suspect was never found. On September 7, 2023, at approximately 12.55 a.m., I, Trooper Killiam, was patrolling Interstate 630 West at Mississippi when I observed a black Nissan Altima bearing traveling in the number three lane. I observed the Altima strike the white dotted line that separates the number four lane from the number three lane and then continue to swerve inside of the lane. I then ran the license plate through the ACIC. At Interstate 630 West and Interstate 430 North, I informed Troop A Communications that I was going to conduct a traffic stop on the vehicle. Once I initiated my emergency lights, the vehicle began to accelerate and the passenger began to throw baggies containing a green leafy substance. Black belt, black belt, white shirt, blue shorts. 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 The Ultima then turned left onto 42nd Street and immediately stopped on Tatum Street and bailed on foot. I pursued after the driver on foot. The driver ran towards 41st Street where he bailed into the wooded area. After inventorying the vehicle, I found an Arkansas ID for a Michael Duane White III. The picture from the ID matched the description of the driver who bailed on foot. I contacted the registered owner of the vehicle, Tanya McBride. She stated that she didn't know who was driving the vehicle. Have a great day, and thanks for watching.